Hey everybody, um, today I've just got a quick video to show you how I store my clear stamps in the three ring binders. Um, these are my Hero Art stamps and you can see that I just kept the um, packaging, the clear sheets they came on, and I just adhered the back um, plastic sheet to a piece of white cardstock and I slipped them in sheet protectors. Um, it's just a easy way to get them out and in the back there you can see some of my older Technique Tuesday stamps and those of course came with the punch it, punched already for the three ring binder. But um, here are just um, my smaller Hero Art stamp sets and I just take them out of their packaging and then keep those sheets that come with them and adhere that back sheet to a piece of white cardstock. Real quick and easy way to see what I have. So um, that's one binder. Um, that's kind of the newer way I've been doing it. This is my other binder that has some more clear stamps and um, for this I just took some 8.5 by 11 transparencies and I've adhered them to those inside the sheet protectors and you can see that I punched some tabs and stuff to uh, distinguish between the different um, manufacturers of stamps that I have. I just haven't done that in my other my newest uh, binder yet, but these um, I'll just show you real quick these stamps. I have them all on a um, transparency, and I just took the uh, sheet that came with it and adhered it to the transparency to the front with some glue dots, and then the stamp is on the back like that. So easy way to um, find the stamp I'm looking for. And I'm just going to flip through here. Um, you can see there's like my font work stamps and stuff like that. And the, they're all stored pretty similarly. Um, here's some autumn leaves stamps. And I may have had to cut that contact sheet that comes with it apart a little bit to make the stamps all fit, especially for some of those autumn leaves sets, but that didn't bother me. And you can see here, I'm doing, I'm storing some of these newer stamp sets, just like I was doing my Hero Arts ones, where um, the sheet, I'm just adhering it to a sheet of white cardstock and then slipping it into my sheet protector. That works a little bit better than my original system, but I'm not going to go back and redo it or anything like that, because I like having all of my stamps in, in my binders like this. So that is that binder. And then I do have um, another system for my 12 by 12 stamp sets from Fancy Pants. Um, I just have this old preservation album from SEI. And for now, that's what I'm using um, because it works really well. I wasn't doing anything with it. So I just slipped the whole 12 by 12 uh, stamp sheet inside one of the sheet protectors. And they already had some white cardstock in there, so it, it makes it really easy to see the design so I know what set I want. So um, that's what I do for these stamp sets, since they didn't really fit into a traditional binder. I may eventually move those to like a, a large 12 by 12 um, three ring binder, but for now I don't have that many sets, so this works really well. So that's just kind of um, those stamps. And that's it. Thanks for watching.